great for them to see like the little bands like us and uh, invest in our future. Toronto Raptors head coach Nick Nurse's foundation is hosting an evening of music tonight. The foundation has already provided money towards programs in the GTA that help young people get access towards musical instruments as well as training and has changed a number of young people's lives. So that donation came at a really important time for us. Um, the middle of the pandemic was really tough on, on everybody. Garrett Lajoie helps run programs at the Hamilton Music Collective which received a $20,000 donation in 2020. That was a huge pick-me-up for us and uh, helped us to uh, design some new programs. Samuel, Emma, Peter, and Jack are all in the Jambassadors program through the Hamilton Music Collective and form the group The Buzz. A program like this is actually really important because there's not a lot of opportunities, like, like you said, to connect with other musicians. The donation from the Nick Nurse Foundation helped bands like The Buzz explore their music and it's helping other young people who want to play in a band like us or play different instruments or learn about producing all these different things or get instruments that maybe they don't have the money to afford. Julia Jung is one of the beloved music teachers at St. Aloysius Gonzaga Secondary School in Mississauga. Their program received a surprise $25,000 donation from the foundation. Which allowed us to go buy a bunch of new instruments. The donation was a moment of joy for a number of the students who were struggling during the pandemic. I was like, oh my god, Nick Nurse knows who we are? Like this random school in Mississauga? I was like, that was like a literally a shocking day. The money helped each student take an instrument home when school shipped it online. Music is really important because we focus on all the transferable skills that they actually learn in music that can take into other careers. Just under two years later, the money is still making a huge impact, with the students wanting to show the coach their gratitude with a performance. Oh, man. Uh, uh, uh. Like, I was really hoping that, that that's what would happen. We'd get instruments, we'd get them lessons, they'd find a groove, or they already had a place and they just needed some assistance, and then they get in groups and bands and hopefully just brings joy to them. For City News, I'm Lindsay Dunn.